Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Village. Uh, so I've been playing my favorite game, which is Attaché Case HD, the organizing simulator. And I don't know if it sounds sarcastic, but let me reassure you, it is not. Uh, I find this immensely satisfying. I'm a very tidy, organized person. Oh, good. Uh, if my space ways to pass the time. isn't clean, my head feels less clear. Um, I also did my errands, all my crafting, selling, shopping, clearing the Duke out Securing off screen. More important than anything. So we're ready anything, to continue. Uh, so let's bank our meat. Don't let up yet. Let's bank our meat and get it on. We're pretty close to a couple mm. of pretty big upgrades. I can hardly wait for the next ingredients. That's so nice that you can bank it. And I believe we're heading out this way, because the other way should be the way we came in. Kind of had to reorient myself there for a second. Been a second since I recorded this. Oh, I, that was, that's the other windmill in the distance. I thought it was something prowling around. Crank is old and busted. It feels like it's going to snap any second. Hope it doesn't break. The only other one we have is uh, over at windmill two. All right. So let's go break this, break this crank and head to windmill two. <laughs> but first, Cheegans. Cheegans. I don't know if, uh... The only thing that we were missing for any of those upgrades was poultry, but I, I'm not going to double back just for that. We're going to have to head back there eventually anyway to turn the generator on. Or to open the sluice gate, whatever we're doing in there. Oh, this is just a freebie? Oh, it's just a crystal fragment. Wow, that that looked like it was gonna be important. Can I? No, I don't think I can blow that open. It'd be a sneaky place to hide, like a goat or something. So we've had vampires inspired by Carmilla. Um, now we have Moreau, who seems to be doing macabre experiments out here by the reservoir. So I would assume that he is inspired by the island of Dr. Moreau. Heisenberg, I get the impression. Uh, seriously? Oh, you saw this coming, Ethan. Come on. Uh, I get the impression that Heisenberg has has Frankenstein vibes going on. What does that leave for Beneviento, though? Like, I'm actually not aware of a classical horror doll story. I mean, like a, a, a seminal one in on the vein, in the vein of like Carmilla or Frankenstein. Obviously, creepy haunted dolls are a pretty pretty common staple in horror. But again, I don't know if there's like that that seminal classic about one in the same way as, as Frankenstein or Carmilla or even the island of Dr. Moreau. Oh, I'm really nervous about treading this. And you're so slow getting across it. There it is. Holy shit. Ooh. Wow, Moreau got a lot more Bloodborne than I was expecting. Oh, 
I don't know, like, what his reach is like, which is the scary part here. Jesus, it really is the son of Del Lago. I hope we don't get a shitty boat boss fight. Not the biggest fan of that Del Lago fight, to be honest. Okay, it's gotta be out here. No? Maybe even further out? Uh... Oh, it's so dicey, the timing. Fuck. So, okay, as long as I'm on one of these solid patches of roof, I seem to be okay. But the... the... Shit. Where? Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no! The floating platforms are the dangerous ones. Wait, where did he go? Is he only gonna spawn when I step onto the onto the platform? Shit, yeah. Okay, we're gonna let him pass. This should be the timing. Yeah, that gave us plenty of time. And now we just don't get gobbled up in a stupid way. Crossing over. Very good. And I think we're solid. Man, this is a really cool environment. It's a shame we're kind of getting chased through here. I don't know what kind of ability he has to threaten me while I'm here, so. Eh? Can't just take a, a look around for a bit, for a second. Oh, okay, that opens up a new path. The hell is this? Ugh, stinks. There you go, Ethan. Channel your inner James. Oh, okay. Oh, that's really spooky. Okay, so these are timed. And there are three different colors, so I'm assuming that corresponds to three different switches. So we have blue and orange. Oh! Uh, oh, okay. What? What? Did the orange one go down while I was waiting for blue to come up? Okay, this time, we're fine. Blue comes up. You just have to be really quick with the orange. I was just really slow because I was figuring everything out before. Okay, that looked spooky. And now we have the third one. Oh, the timing of this is going to be so fucked. Okay, so there's orange, yellow, and then we hit blue out here. And there's no way I'm going to make this. But I think I see how this is supposed to work. Let's test it out. You know, orange, blue. Very quickly, quickly, quickly. Please. Please, I beg of you. Hit blue. Oh, my God. Um, We're good. I hesitated. And then where is... Oh, I have to use that orange switch. Okay. This one is gonna be a little bit nerve-wracking. Especially because I don't know if Moreau can actually get to me on these platforms. It doesn't seem like it, which thank fucking Buddha for that. 
Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> Oh, I think this is it. <gasps> no! Uh. Oh, this is it. This is... Uh, yeah, this is the one. This is it. This is it. This is it. Nope. Come on. Quick, quick, quick. Quick turn. Oh, I didn't hit the switch! Come on. Please? No. Please. Oh, this one already feels kind of bad. Well, then we hit this one. Quick turn. Uh, uh. Ooh, we did it! That part honestly took me so many attempts. Like, kind of a ridiculous number. Woo! Free Willy. Ooh! White! 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 Oh, good. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. I did not see that coming. <laughs> oh, Moreau's having fun. Okay, we have a little bit of a breather, I think. Oh. Is this the same place as before? No. I don't think so. No, it's not. I thought we went in a, in a big circle for a second. Holy shit. That made me jump. This section is so good for just generating jump scares. Like, it's such a good way to, to startle you. And they proved that the threat is real a few times. Like that last death where I walked right into his jaws. That looked to me like it was going to be another one of those, those set piece moments, but nah, he just gobbled me up. Caught myself a big one. Ethan, you are so goddamn corny. Need to get out of here. That's why we love Ethan. We love and respect Ethan somehow. <laughs> We love a committed family, man. <laughs> With infinite pain tolerance. Oh, hello. This is really helpful. Really, the music is really giving me the impression that I'm gonna get stabbed in the gut as soon as I cross this threshold. I guess it kind of was leading up to some kind of punctuation. <laughs> oh, there we go. What the hell? K 
can't climb up like this. Oh, we have to rotate the, the windmill. Is, is Ethan's left hand getting infected or am I, or am I just nuts? It looks noticeably worse. I don't know, maybe not. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> I am, however, not super convinced that Moreau can, like, knock the windmill down with me on it. Ooh! Even knowing that's not gonna kill me, that still makes you clench up a little bit. I like that. Damn, where is VR mode for this? That would have been sick in VR! Okay. What in the hell? Oh, cool, we have gone all the way around. We've come full circle back to uh, the sluice gate control. Uh, is the inside of here any different since we rotated things around? No, it doesn't seem like it. Crank to start the electricity, pull the lever in the gatehouse to open. Okay, that's that's more text than is required. And then this. Oh, I have to rotate this so the blank spot's over on the left or the right. Okay. This one is fine. White here is fine. We want to change you to white. Then you to blue. And which one am I missing? Oh. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now we'll just revisit the Duke real quick. Well then, oh my god! Did the poultry give us enough for anything? Don't uh, almost. It gives us four out of four for that. I you just remembered Kiel Theory saying the merchant looks like Monster Factory's boy mare of second life. And that's been living in my brain rent-free since I read it. Ooh, okay. So that transformation was 100% involuntary, it seems. Either that or he can't transform back. One might even be led to believe that a boss fight might be coming. Either that or I am going to get jumped. This is where the street sharks from Bloodborne show up and just start ripping through me. 
October 1st, a sunny day, Mother Miranda brought me five peoples from the village, just like I asked it. I made them sleep with some liquid, and then I put Kado in their tummies. I'm looking forward to the Kado to grow in their tummies. October 2nd, a cloudy day. Four of the people from the village are dead this morning. One is almost a lichen. I sent it to my lab on the mountain. I failed again. Mother wants strong vessels, but I can't get any. I'll need more people from the village. Oh yeah, that's super Dr. Moreau. Ooh, high capacity mag for the 1911. Wow, that looks terrible. <laughs> it looks so goofy. Man, I'm it, it's um, it's kind of a bummer that Moreau's area is almost over already, and we didn't get a new enemy type introduced here. Something was coming. I didn't quite think it was going to be that. Oh, wait. Oh! Um. No, I think we're good to cross. What in the hell is he doing? Oh, there he is. Shit, shit, shit. I waited too long. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's more. I didn't notice that before. Okay, we gotta skedaddle. There's some, there's some stuff there that I didn't pick up. I'm gonna have to remember that for later. Uh, we can we can temporarily replace Knifey for now. Ooh! Ah! Oh my God! Like little acid rain. Shit. Oh, okay. There are some grooved bits. Oh my god, that hurt. And I can't get to the inside of his mouth from this angle. Ah. Uh. Oh. This is a cool fight. There's quite a bit going on, actually. I like it. It's making good... Hello? Wow, he looks... Oh, there is a Metroid boss that I'm... I cannot think of the name of right now. But wow, he looks a lot like that Metroid boss. <laughs> when he's all bloated and distended, belching acid... God, the, the, the village boss designs have been really on point. It's just some fun, cool monsters. Oh, shit. Is he doing that thing again? No. Oh, my God. That's kind of spooky. I didn't even notice this was open. Hey! Well, this might end up hurting me. This should be better. Ooh, ooh, 
Ooh. Okay, we're good. Oh, he's gonna do the thing again. So we're just gonna chill here. Enjoy the rain. Oh, that spawns the goo. Make sure our weapons are reloaded. Then maybe see if we can peek out and take a pot shot or two. Oh, the weak point isn't exposed. That must still do a little bit of damage, though. Oh, that worried me. I think I could pop one more off before I have to run. Maybe more. Good, I'll be able to unload. He's having trouble with that, with that post. But I don't want to cheese him out too much, so I'm going to do the honorable thing. Yes. I'm going to do the honorable thing and shoot him while he's down. Crystal Moreau. As he was in life. Disgusting. I'm enjoying these boss fights. And now to scavenge. Oh, right, mines. I really didn't make... I had four of them, too. I didn't make... That would have been the perfect opportunity to make use of them. Ah. Must not forget Knifey. He is our friend and savior. And we do not forsake Knifey. I am going to kill the final boss with the knife. Mark my words. Mark my words. Me and Knifey have an appointment with Mother Miranda, but first we have to deal with Heisenberg still. The exit's up ahead. Oh, right, we already have the flask. We got that before we started the level. Oh, shit. Mother Miranda gave me a rose jar. No one likes me, which is why I thought they would leave me out again. But Heisenberg said... That was why we, I just, why we each get a rose. The ceremony cannot happen without all of us here. Oh, mother didn't seem to care, though. They anticipated my joke. I was going to make a joke about the rose ceremony. <laughs> mother said rose is a vessel. With a vessel, mother can get his, her real child back, even though she's been dead for a very long time. But if mother does, but if mother does, then what will happen to me? I'm not a real child. Would she abandon me? No, I don't want that. No, 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 You've got fight. I'll give you that, Ethan. But what's the plan when you have all four flasks? What are you trying to get at? I could lend you a hand. Not trying to get on my good side? I don't get cocky. 
I'd kill you if you weren't worth the trouble. There's a stronghold not too far outside the village. Go there and get my flask. Do that, and you pass. First, head back to the graveyard. Self-centered prick. Is that alive? Is there anything else to see around here? Oh, there's Moreau's hidden weapon. Where is that? There, it, what? There's nothing that connects to that? On the map? Uh, now I'm extremely worried that I just missed it. I'm gonna take a quick look around and make sure that I didn't miss anything too important. Because that sounds pretty important. Ooh, hello, this is something. That, wait. This is not Moreau's hidden weapon, is it? Oh, very valuable. And there are fish here. Fishy, 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 fishy. Eh, fishy, fishy. Pss, 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 pss. Don't tell me that doesn't work on fish. You don't know. Well, I scoured the area, couldn't find anything of, of real value beyond the statue and the fish. Uh, and like a couple stray handgun bullets and flash grenades, so... We're taking the elevator up. We are calling it a wrap, and if I missed Moreau's hidden weapon, man... Oh well. Oh, cool. Okay. So... With that done, that is going to do it for today. Thank you all for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one, y'all.